Hello everyone, this is John, um, data science career transition expert. Welcome you all to this another educational video on data science and artificial intelligence related uh, career and its practices. Today I would like to talk about hacker rank. What is this particular hacker rank? So that is what I'm here to address. Hacker rank, it is nothing but a bridge between you, that is a data science learner and the employer. So bridge meaning what? So when you're learning data science or any other job role, so you're going to get into Naukri and you're going to upload your resume and the recruiters or the hiring managers, they are going to come to you uh, by uh, seeing this particular resume. If this particular resume really impresses them, they're going to give a call to you. Naukri is a bridge. LinkedIn, so you're having a great portfolio in LinkedIn by doing some regular post. And then if you're recruiting, sorry, if you're reaching out to some hiring managers, they see your portfolio in LinkedIn. And if they really like it, they are going to schedule a call with you. In a similar way, hacker rank is also a bridge between you, data science learner, and the employer. So here, what is the purpose of this particular hacker rank? Because Naukri has its own purpose. LinkedIn has its own purpose. Hacker rank is also having a one purpose. Hacker rank purpose, nothing, but it is a coding platform. So where exactly? So if you are a data science learner, so companies wanted to test your coding skills. So what they're exactly doing recently in 2023, most of the companies, they are trying to give you hacker rank related problem statement, coding related problem statement, and they are going to assess your technical skills. So in 2023, it is very much important for a data science learner to focus on hacker rank also and work on a lot of problem statement and increase your visibility. So that is what this hacker rank is all about. So let me ask this particular Google, okay, hey, what is this? hacker rank i'm just typing it here i'm sharing my screen so here you can see hacker rank it is an online coding test and technical interviews hacker rank is the market leading technical assessment and remote interview solution for hiring developers so it is very clear that is for hirement process sorry for uh, recruitment process hiring managers are using hacker rank they are identifying some challenging problem statement in hacker rank and they are going to give to you meaning data science learner to assess your technical skills okay let me click on this hacker rank here I'm able to see first is nothing but first you have to sign up so I'm not going to sign up here but uh, you can just click on sign up there are a few basic steps like it will ask your first name last name your email ID and set up the password so once it is done click on this for for candidates you'll be finding this particular option and uh, then log in okay so I'm just going to log in with respect to my email account itself so it is getting logged in so once it is logged in here this is your dashboard Okay, so like problem certification, if you wanted to do this problem solving for Python, so or uh, basic or intermediate level, you can, you're able to see. So you can prepare by topics like algorithm, artificial intelligence. So these are all the different topics here we are able to see. So now when you're uh, a data science learner or an AI learner, you need to first start with respect to this Python. So now if I'm clicking on this particular Python, I'm able to see the complete dashboard. What are all the different problems here I'm able to see. Okay, now here I'm stopping this particular video. So in this video, we learned about what is this particular hacker rank. Hacker rank is nothing but what? It is a bridge between employer and a data science learner, where it is must for us to increase our visibility or, or to prove to our employers that we are also good in coding skills. We have to have a great hacker rank portfolio ready. For that, how to get started with respect to hacker rank, I just shared what is hacker rank. In the next video, I'll be talking about how to use a hacker rank in a more effective manner. So that's what the next video follows. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hope this video helped you all. So maybe if you like it, you can hit the thumbs up button or like button in this particular video, maybe down somewhere. In case if you would like to talk to us, so there will be a button, there will be a number given below in the description box. Feel free to contact us. But in the next video, I'll be sharing about how to use a cycle rank in a more effective manner so let's get uh, tuned for that thank you so much have a good day bye